Amazon is huge. When they announced they were looking for a location for their second HQ, it broke the internet. Little day in what's become a fierce competition. Five billion dollar plus investment. More than a hundred communities across North America. Are Hundreds of cities would be competing for Amazon's attention, including Calgary, Canada. With 50,000 jobs and billions of dollars at stake, we needed a way to stand out from the crowd. We needed to think like advertisers, not economic developers. So, what is a Calgary? 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 People may think Calgary is cold. Cold makes people in Calgary really freaking tough. People may think Calgary is pretty old school. But in fact, Calgary welcomes all walks of life. People may think Calgary is remote, but it just makes the city closer to an epic playground. People may think Calgary is small, but it's a city of over a million people that still feels like a small town. We poked a bit of fun at all the rain in Seattle, and in typical fashion, we poked fun at Calgary too. We plastered these not-so-humble brags everywhere, on huge banners, right next to Amazon's offices, in Seattle print publications, on digital out of home in the Seattle airport, on the very ground on Amazon's own turf, on the sidewalks of Seattle, and online with paid media on sites like LinkedIn, and a video on YouTube. Then we wrapped it all in a pretty bow and hand-delivered Calgary's bid to Amazon. Then Amazon didn't select Calgary, but Calgary still won. Hashtag Amazon YYC started trending on Twitter. The campaign ended up with 150 million impressions and some serious coverage. In the end, a hyper-local strategy served up far-reaching results, putting Calgary on the map.